Hi YouTube, I'm Afro40, welcome to my channel. So it is a beautiful morning, it's the very last day of December. I hope you guys are all well. It's New Year's Eve guys, so I thought I would wake up and record this video about how I take my hair from being curly to straight and some other news that I would like to announce to you guys for the year of 2016. But anyway, yes guys, I actually woke up like this, well, I've brushed my teeth because I don't want to show you guys any kind of gooeyness, um, washed my face, but basically I woke up like this and this is one of those mornings when you wake up and your silk scarf is no longer on your head, so my hair is a hot mess. Let me see if I can focus this in, can you guys see the lighting in this room is kind of all over the place, but it is a hot mess, I have got tons and tons of build up guys, so anyway, like I said this video it's all about taking you on my journey from uh, from whoops from curly to straight. So if you want to see how I go from looking like this to this, and keep watching. Hi guys, so I've just finished washing my hair. It's still dripping wet. Sorry if you can see the water dripping, but um, I just want to give this product a bit of a plug because. This isn't normally a brand that I would reach for if I were going shopping for hair um, shampoo but um, this came free in a sample pack from a hair event that I went to earlier on this year and it's the Design Essentials uh, Curl Cleanser and it's sulfate free and I have to say I was really impressed with the way this lathered. I only used a small amount per section and it actually lathered up really well and it didn't. my hair didn't feel stripped or anything afterwards so big plug to Design Essentials for their shampoo. Okay, so this is the stage at which I am going to prep my hair for deep conditioning and my deep conditioner that I'm going to use today is the 10 in 1 Renewal from Shea Moisture. I love this deep conditioner because it really does penetrate my hair and I use a method that I've coined double deep conditioning and I'll show you exactly what I do. So basically I am going to take down each section of my hair right now and begin to apply oh, hang on, it's cold. begin to apply um, my conditioning mask okay if you can see bits of water flicking that just shows you exactly how wet my hair is so I'm just gonna just dab it with my towel so I don't want it dripping everywhere and basically that's um, what the product looks like as you can see it's quite thick and I spare no mercy with this on my hair. I literally just slap it on and I make sure my hair is completely saturated with the product. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna come back when I finish and show you guys exactly what that means. Hey guys, so I finished um, applying the deep conditioning mask to my hair and as you can see, it's super, super, super saturated. I'll just bring you guys closer. Can you see? I've got tons of it in my hair. Look, <laughs> I've emptied out the whole pot. Anyway, so when I say double deep condition, what I mean is I'm trying to pack as much heat as I can in my hair during the deep conditioning process. So I use clean film first of all to wrap my hair. Now this is the cheapest variety of clean film you can come across. It's from the pound store probably the equivalent of a dollar store if you're in America and you're watching so basically I just wrap my hair with this stuff so I'm sealing in the deep conditioner and the moisture I'm sealing it with this clip film okay so I just wrap my hair like that and then no expense spared I put on a plastic cap okay and I'm going to sit under my hairdryer for 40 minutes, okay? And this baby is going to steam, it's going to steam and when you see the results of that will be that my hair will be super, 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 super moisturised. So I'll come back in 40 minutes. It's a cloudy day, the lighting in here's not the best. This is my hooded dryer that I got off eBay. It was second hand, only cut. 
cost me 99 pounds I don't know how much it sells for new But I'm so glad that it is mine Okay, so I set this for medium heat for 40 minutes and I go under it and I shall see you guys when I'm done. Bye! So hey guys, my camera ran out of battery so I'm just recharging it so hopefully it would have recharged by the time I get to the flat ironing stage. So I have just washed out the conditioner from my hair and I've blotted my hair with my towel so that it's not dripping. So I just wanted to show you guys a close up of the hair. This is what I'm saying about it being super, super moisturised when you deep condition. And the good thing about that conditioner I find for me is that um, my hair, that you know, really does have strength afterwards. It feels really strong, the strands, which is good if they're about to flat iron. So anyway, so the next stage now is just to prep my hair for blow drying. So I am going to be using this, which is the Chi Keratin Mist, and this is like a leave-in strengthening treatment that's really good for if you're about to apply heat to your hair. So I just basically take down my sections and I'm going to spritz my hair with this stuff, making sure that I get it all in there, making sure each of the strands are covered. I just smooth it through to make sure that it's evenly distributed through my hair. Especially towards the, the ends as well. So I'm just going to carry on doing this and I'll come back when I finish this bit and I'll show you the next bit. Okay, so here's the next stage. I've finished applying the keratin mist. So now I'm going to apply this, which is grapeseed oil. Grapeseed oil is a good natural heat protectant. So this is what I'm going to apply before I blow dry. So here we go. cover my hair from root to tip making sure that it all is distributed evenly so I'm just gonna go over it with a, um, a comb just before I get to the last stage anyway. so I'm gonna do this for each of four sections and I'll come back and show you guys how I blow dry. So I've got my uh, blow dry to the ready now. I'm using the fabulous um, Pro Speed 2100 and it's an ionic hair dryer so I think that's meant to reduce your drying time and also give you like um, less frizz and shine to your hair when you're using it. So I'm going to put this on a medium setting and begin to blow dry. Okay guys, so we are done blow drying. That was pretty quick actually. I think I did that in about 15 or 20 minutes. So that's pretty quick. So I'm just going to put a final two blasts of air through my hair just to make sure that that cuticle lays back down. Okay, so
Hi guys, I'm back after my camera has fully charged up again so we can get going for the um, flat ironing process. Now for that I am going to be using the chase method and I'll be using this double Denman brush to achieve that. The flat iron I'm using for this stage is the Babyliss Nano Titanium Flat Iron and as you can see it's got very smooth plates. Now I've got this on a heat setting of 375, I don't know if you can see that, it's probably blurred, but it's 375 anyway. So let's begin, oh and I forgot to mention I will be using this silk infusion, okay so I'm going to put that in my hair just before I begin the process. Okay so I have detangled my hair, on this side anyway, and the key to a really good flat iron is to work in very, very tiny sections. So as you can see, I've got a very small section of hair here. So I'm going to take my flat iron and basically I'm going to just start by pressing the roots. Okay, so I'm going to, let me just bring this a bit closer. Okay. So I'm going to start with the roots and just hold it there. Just run it there through the roots couple of times and then I'm going to take my double denim and plus my hair with it there and get my flat iron once again and just basically chase it through to the tips of my hair. I'm going to go really slowly too just to make sure I get the ends Okay, so you can see that's just one pass and I'm going to stand up so you guys can see. Okay, so that was one pass. Come on camera, focus. That's it. So that was basically one pass. Okay, now I'll move on to the next. seems a little bit too thick so I'm going to break that down into half okay. so once again get my flat iron and basically just going to go with the roots and I'm going to get my denim Last bit there at the roots, and basically, I'm just going to chase the hair through. Once again, one pass. One pass was all that was needed.
Okay, so this is the final bit of hair, and I'm just gonna put, section this into two parts because it's a bit too big. And actually, I might make it three. Let's make it three. Well, we'll see. We'll see. Have to clip this out of the way. Okay, so just make sure that it's thoroughly detangled, and then I'm going to. Ah, hold on. Sorry guys, um, my plug came out of the socket. Anyway, so, okay. Okay, that's that one done. I'll tuck that out of the way. And I'm tempted to just do this in one, but I'm going to exercise patience since I've been exercising patience for the last, I'm not going to say how long. <laughs> it takes ages, this process, because I'm doing them in such tiny sections. But yeah. So, demo brush. One pass, guys, that's all it takes. One pass. And, okay, final piece. Yippee, yippee, yay. Okay, I think I am done. So, I've got my hair clipped at the back here with these crocodile clips, so I'm just going to release them. Hold on, let me turn off my iron as well, my straightening iron. And here is the final result. Let me just adjust my camera and I'll be back. So this is where we are lengthwise at the moment. I'll just comb that up for you guys. <clears throat> so this is where we are now. So come March we'll see the difference between now and then. So guys, I've been teasing you guys for a number of weeks now, talking about how I've got this big announcement for the year 2016. So I'm going to share it with you guys now, seeing that this is the last day of 2015. Um, I am going to stop taking Mineral Ridge. Not because there's anything wrong with it, not because it didn't work, but because I am looking to change my uh, hair growth vitamin to something that I feel will take me to my goal, which is to hit waist length. So I've been researching this company for a long time. Um, I've been following them on Instagram. I've been watching reviews from other women who have used their product. And I've decided to go with the main choice, main tabulism. Now, the CEO of this company is a lady called Courtney Adelaide. And if you check her out, I shall leave the link to her website below. You will see that she has the most glorious, beautiful long hair. And she tested these vitamins on herself. I followed her when she was on YouTube and I um, watched her growth journey. And um, 
all the products that the company sells are products that she formulated herself and products that she has tested on her own hair so I actually trust this brand and so I am going with them for the next three months I've purchased myself three bottles of these tablets in the Black Friday sales so they were half price so that was a really good bargain so I'm going to start taking them as of tomorrow now so the next time you see me um, showing you guys the length of my hair it will be in March 2016 by the grace of God and um, yeah so we shall see how I get on with taking these um, uh, I, I, the formulation is slightly different to uh, Maximum Niven although very similar um, ingredients are in it now if you want to know more about this vitamin you can check out their website I shall leave the link below as I said before but other than that just to let you guys know that's going to be my new vitamin for 2016 and I'm looking forward and expecting good things from this so watch this space now I just want to say to all everyone that has been following me either on Instagram or whether you've been watching my videos whether you are an old subscriber or a newbie or if this is the first time you are coming across my video I want to wish you all a very very happy new year and thank you so much for following me thank you for encouraging thank you for supporting me thank you for all your comments and your suggestions I hope that I've been able to address all of them and where I haven't been able to I hope that I've pointed you to someone who can um, so once again guys thank you so much for watching have a really safe new year celebration and I hope to see you real soon in the very next video bye